Hi you guys, welcome back to another vlog. Today's Wednesday. I actually have the day off today and then I took half a day tomorrow because I'm getting my hair done tomorrow. Today I'm just gonna get some errands done. I have to make a return. I remember telling you guys previously I had two packages delivered to the wrong house. The people, oh my god, I'm watching Smokey look out the front blinds and he looks so cute with his little face. The crows have been like going nuts lately. I don't know if they have like a nest nearby or something, but they are extremely loud. Um, but like I was saying, I had two packages delivered to the wrong I ended up returning them. He kind of fibbed a little bit cause he was like, I came back three times, this, this and that, but I have cameras everywhere and I would have obviously seen that. Um, but that's okay. They were open but all the stuff was inside so i just like reached back out to the company and whatever so i have to return the stuff because they ended up resending it to me i asked i just reached out to them i was like i know you resent this do you want me just to like send it back with the return label so i'm gonna go drop that off at ups and then i think i'm gonna run to tj maxx and home goods i'm dying laughing because his little tiny white nose is staring directly out at me through the window and I've never seen him do that before. I'm gonna go to TJ Maxx and Home Goods just because it's been forever since I've been. I just kind of want to look around, see what they have, and kind of start meal piecing the house. I want to get the back room done. I really need some decor, and then I need to go online and look at how to do like DIY track curtains to put on our back slider, um, so we can get rid of those awful blinds back there that like just constantly are making so much noise, and the cat is always running through them and. I just hate having those. And then um, I might run into Target. I've been seeing a lot of stuff on bead embroidery that I really wanna try. I have most of the stuff. I would just need um, like two or three things. So maybe I'll stop and get that, maybe not. Maybe I'll do that a different day. So basically we're just gonna run some errands and I figured I would vlog today. Finally wearing my little seashell necklace that I got off Etsy and I love it. Actually, it is like hollowed out in the back. Um, but it actually has some like decent weight to it. I love it. It is heating up so fast and it's only 10.30, but I just got out of TJ Maxx. I just got a couple of things. I'm trying to be better about like not impulse buying stuff just because it's like good deal or whatever, but I needed some new loofahs. I love this Bliss brand. And then I just got the like face and body gloves because I want to start doing my self tan again. And then I tried a few cute clothes on. Um, again, like if I wasn't super in love, I didn't get it because I just know I won't wear it. But I did get this like long sleeve button up. It's actually Zara. Um, but I just love the material, whether I use it for like a swimsuit cover up or um, just with like linen shorts or pants. You know, I just love the stripe. And I feel like this like color style is like sold out everywhere right now. And the last thing I got was these sandals which I saw something similar from Farm Rio and they were like super expensive they're not identical but like similar style and it says that they are genuine leather but they're just like black with the brown love I lied that wasn't it I also got just a little dry bar wide tooth comb I needed just like a new wide tooth comb I can't find mine anywhere to like you know brush out the curls. I made it home literally before the rain started. I was going to show you guys what I got in the car at all the different places, but I just had to beat the rain and I almost didn't go to Target, but I'm glad I just went and got it done and I did not get wet. But I ran into Home Goods and the only thing I got were four of these plates, but they're basically just like a creamy color with this blue around the edges. And I needed plates that are like this medium size. Um, we only have like our big plates and then appetizer plates, but no like salad plates or just like regular You know dinner portion plates that aren't like fancy. So I just grabbed four of these they had five um, I probably would have gotten six because that's like what my dinner table 
seats and that tends to be like a good number for us but there was only five and the fifth one looked kind of funky like the blue color was off and those were $5.99 which I feel like is pretty good um they're really they feel really high quality and it does say dishwasher oven freezer and microwave safe and then I did end up running into Michael's to get the couple things I would need to do the embroidery like on a tank top so I just got the heat bond i think this is to like put on the back of where you do the embroidery just to like keep it all together i've seen that like you don't have to do this it was like 2.99 so i figured if i wanted to try it i would have it and then i just got two different sizes of embroidery hoops to keep like the fabric stretch so i figure if i'm doing a smaller one it'll just be easier to have one that's not so like gigantic while you're working on it I really got this stuff because we have a road trip in like the next month and it's like a 14 hour drive so I figured um, this would be like a good something to do in the car instead of just sitting on my phone. So I got the thread that I needed and the little beading needles. I think the only other thing I need that they were out of stock was like a water soluble pencil or pen to draw your design on before you embroider it and then it'll come off obviously when you wash it. And then I just ran into Target. I just needed some kind of random stuff. I just grabbed some mouthwash. And then um, in the summertime, I like to use, I feel like I'm so bright and it's because this weather is just crap and it's so gloomy out. Um, in the summertime, because I'm always wearing like flip flops and like less cushiony shoes, I feel like my feet suffer a little bit. Um, and like my regular lotion does not keep them as soft as I would like. So I like to buy this foot cream but basically i bought this one because it has the ingredient urea in it i think that's how you say it but it's really good to for like any rough spots or like even if you have rough like elbows or knees this stuff works it does kind of have a strong scent as you could imagine a foot cream would have but just nice to keep your feet soft in the summer and then i just grabbed some inexpensive tanks to do the embroidery and if i don't these are like these honestly might be my new favorite tank. I need to try it on. Um, but I love the thicker on the neck. So I got a black one and then I got a gray one. This one I might not embroider anything with, but I just, you guys know me and my tank top. So I love a tank top. And then I got two white ones specifically for that. And I think these were like six, seven bucks. Yeah, so perfect for like a little craft project i saw people like buying ones off of like brandy and stuff but i didn't want to wait for that to come in and like this is just a for fun thing like if i actually really got into it you could buy a higher quality tank top although i feel like these will be just fine i got enough like thickness i think to make that work and then i showed you guys everything from tj maxx and that was basically it i found some cute stuff at home goods there was this bench that i really loved but i just don't know where right now i would put it and i kind of need to get that together before i start buying stuff i'm trying to be better about that and then i saw these green pillows which i might i might regret not grabbing they definitely are probably mo not most people's style but i want like a velvet or like a linen for the two chairs in the back but i need to order the rug first which i'm still like i'm looking for one but i haven't found one that i really love and i just don't want to spend a ton of money on a rug with the cats and stuff um obviously my cats have claws so if it's like the right material they do like to kind of try to scratch it so i don't want to spend like a bunch of money and then as expected they're gonna pull little pulls in it you know all throughout so i really need to sit down and kind of like design out what i want to do instead of just trying to bring stuff home you know i need to actually like plan it a little bit better but that's it i'm gonna sit down i need to edit a video because it's been a week since i posted the last one that's kind of been the routine is like one a week um but hopefully things will kind of like settle down so i have a little bit more time to edit and vlog and stuff good morning you guys I'm looking a little scary. I just got out of a body shower. I wanted to make sure I got my workout in before I go get my hair done because I knew I wouldn't want to do it afterwards and like 
risk ruining my hair on the first day because it's always the best day but it is almost 9 30 so i'm gonna go head to her i only took half the day off so when i get back i'll have to get on work for like four hours but it is what it is i'm excited we're gonna try i think something different so i don't have such a stark contrast between my highlights and my natural hair color and maybe add more layers i think is what we're leaning towards Hi you guys, it's been a while. I've gotten home and I had to work like half day today. So it's a little after 6.30 and I'm finally done. And I was like rushing to get home because it took longer than I expected, but I got my hair done. I feel like it's showing up blonder on camera than it actually is, but we did like a shadow root. I feel like you could see that. And then like under is all done too just to help with the growth so she like pulled down some darker pieces and then obviously i had a lot of blonde to begin with um it's definitely coming off lighter on camera though it might be because of this window but it's definitely not like that white icy blonde that i used to get when i would leave and i'm kind of liking it i feel like it's a different change for it being summer typically you'd want to be lighter but i'm just so over like that dark root coming out like by four weeks and I feel like I have to get my hair done already so hopefully this will help with like the regrowth like you could tell um the shadow root on the top but I think I like it and we added a lot more layers and like thinned out my ends so they're not so blunt and I don't have like super thick hair like a lot of hair I'm like fall right in the middle I don't have a little amount of hair but I don't have tons and sometimes the ends can look blunt so we kind of like thinned out the ends but i think i like it see the sun's going away you could tell it's a little bit darker my mom ended up coming over because ryan had things to do tonight so we went to kava they opened a kava closer to me and actually it was my first time there and it was really good i got like the grains and greens bowl and it was super good their steak was really good which like i'm always afraid to get a chipotle like it's always so fatty but it was really good i can't believe i've never been before there's plenty around in like Tampa and stuff, but it just never was like at the right place, the right time to go there. So that was super good. And then we just ran into, we were gonna go to Home Goods, but it was getting late. It's already almost nine. So we just ran into Hobby Lobby before they closed because I wanted to get some beads to do my little embroidery project for my little road trip here in the next month. I wanna do like a seashell one to start with because i feel like it's a pretty basic um design so i just got some things to do like some little outlines and then if i wanted to do like a little oyster shell or something but i just thought these were pretty for like a classic little beach shell so i just grabbed those these are like the beads that i already had but they're just like plain simple you know like little seed beads so i wanted some like pretty accent ones also this is the target tanks that i got yesterday they're eight bucks a piece i will link these these are like the best tank that i have found in a while they're like super thick in comparison even to like the aritzia one that i just bought it does have like the thicker straps but barely see-through i just put like some nipple covers on um but for eight dollars and they had a bunch of different colors so nice and i love it and i feel like it's the perfect length like it's not too cropped but you can kind of like bunch it up you know to make it a little bit shorter if you want but it's not like a full length but i'm just gonna sit on the couch and relax i'm thinking about maybe starting to try this embroidery stuff i don't have like the little chalk marker or whatever you're supposed to use so that it rinses off so i'm gonna google to see if there's something else i can use that'll stay but kind of tired it's been a long day the hair salon took me forever and then work and then it was nice to get out of the house though on a thursday i feel like it kind of extends your weekend a little bit but i think that's all i really wanted to get done for tonight it's gonna take me a while for this hair to grow on me i'm used to being really bright at the top but i think it'll grow on me i feel like it looks a little more natural i don't know 